centre. Let's go back now to that emergency situation in Katoomba. And I'm joined on the phone by Deputy Commissioner Rob Rogers from the Rural Fire Service. Deputy Commissioner, thanks for your time this evening. What can you tell us about the fire at the moment? Uh, look, Chris, the fire is still burning quite aggressively in that area and um, and basically uh, we can confirm now there's two homes that have been lost, um, also another one severely damaged uh, and other ones affected by fire. So uh, until those winds back off, fire crews are going to find it very difficult going in that area. What's the real difficulty for fires tonight? Will it, will it be the winds or the fact that you're basically up against a cliff with these flames, aren't you? Yeah, look, it's both really, Chris, um, and, and also the fact that whilst we've had a southwesterly wind change, the winds won't die off until about 8 o'clock tonight, so they will start to slowly die off, but they've obviously been blowing, as you would be aware, all day, and they're continuing to blow, so um, obviously until those winds ease off, we're going to have uh, our work cut out for us. We, we just, uh, we're just looking at photos of, of water bombing. How successful is that in this sort of situation, or do you really just need people on the ground? Oh, look, the, the helicopters are very important for slowing the fire down as it approaches the properties, but obviously uh, it still needs firefighters and boots on the ground. So um, the RFS and the fire rescue firefighters up there are doing a great job protecting as many properties as they can. And just on residents, have they been evacuated and left their homes? Uh, look, some are staying in their properties, but some have been evacuated, I understand, to a golf course area. And, and they're doing OK? Yeah, look, we have no information of any injuries. Uh, look, one of our trucks was impacted by fire, but all the crew are OK. Um, so uh, luckily there's no injuries or, or obviously worse. All right, busy night ahead for you. Thank you very much, Deputy Commissioner, for your time this evening. Uh, we wish you well in the fight in Katoomba. Rob, Rob Rogers there on the phone, the Deputy Commissioner of the Rural Fire Service, and we'll bring you more details as they come.